Uh, the most important thing that I have gained from the JSI at Michigan was turning my one of my weaknesses into my strength. Coming into the program, I didn't think I was the most confident in my quantitative abilities, uh, but being at the Ford School and during the JSI program, uh, I was around individuals who came from different areas um, academically and their backgrounds, as well as being surrounded by professionals uh, who had not only the patience but the knowledge uh, to instill upon me a sense of confidence for me to turn my weakness into a strength. PPIA has benefited me in a lot of ways. It's allowed me to meet a lot of people from different walks of life, consider careers and trainings that I wouldn't have gone to otherwise. So for example, in the past few years, I've attended a lot of political campaign trainings and whether or not I actually run for office is another issue, but at least now I know that I have the skills to do that if I choose to. Um, PPA is, is exclusive but in a very good way. The people who are in PPA, who have done PPA historically, want to be of service and want to help the folks who are coming down the line. And so um, being a member has its perks, has its benefits, and I would definitely encourage all, anybody to apply to this program. The PPA program uh, changed my life. Uh, it changed what I was, you know, what I intended to do after school. I, I, which was thinking to be a lawyer and a policy just made a lot more sense. Uh, you can do a lot more outside the courtroom um, in terms of crafting policy and thinking about um, how people can be included in the decision making process throughout government and have trans sort of like a more transparent policy making process. From my time at Michigan, I gained a friend group that uh, has remained with me uh, to this day, uh, friends that I have, will have for the rest of my life. I gained a uh, professional network uh, that has helped carry me through my undergraduate career into my early professional career and now grad school. Uh, and I've gained a new understanding of uh, public policy and what it means to work in this field. Following grad school, um, I'm weighing a number of options. I'm thinking about uh, pursuing more education, specifically in education policy. I'm also thinking about um, consultancy, getting a job. Um, so being a PPIA, it kind of Aside from the academics, gives you a greater context as to what's out there for you, um, and the, the educational component, you can you can kind of specialize in whatever you want to, just being a member of the PPA program. So after graduation, I would love to work at a university because my path so far has been diversity in higher education. I would love to work in the admissions office or diversity, equity, and inclusion office at a university. So after grad school, I'd like to pursue uh, a career in looking at transportation policy, um, specifically thinking about how public transportation is something that many communities around the country don't have access to. Um, and I, I think I'm really interested also in um, public and private partnerships and how we can use, leverage assets that already exist to, um, to be able basically to proliferate um, access for the communities that are depending on transportation. I know that I might either work domestically or internationally, so right now I'm trying to balance the two and find um, where I fit in best because um, I've learned a lot about myself through PPIA and also through my time at the Ford School. Now I know what I look for in a career and I know that it's going to take a while to find the best fit, but I know that I'm well prepared for it.